Zone 4 finals. It's the big one, Richard, the one that I think everybody has been excited about this weekend. Not just the money on the line, not just the players involved, but the chance to call yourself a champion in this region. No doubt the most stacked zone where there were so many teams that took part across, you know, weeks onto months of online qualifiers, conferences, playoffs. And now they finally got here, the two of the best. It'll be Makers against Estrella. So I'm looking forward to this one. It's such a fascinating affair as well because, granted, yes, Principe does have to play more games in this series, but you saw in that interview, is really, really, he's saying, I only need to win one game. He's got full confidence in Oli Boli beating Aga on two separate matches. If Principe can get that win, it really does spice up this tie. Part of the team that got them out of the groups, got them through the qualifiers. When these two did match up in the groups, Usta won four goals to one. That's a question whether that's going to be some of the plays in the mind here. Ball into the box, Ronaldo's there, that's our first goal! In this grand final, 13 minutes on the clock. And as I said, Houston, he beat him in the group stages, he wants to continue that momentum in this grand final. 14 minutes in, there's your first goal. Astralis against Makers, not a football club in sight in this zone grand final. Two esports organisations battling out. That's what this competition's all about, that mixture of Football clubs, esports organisations battle out to be the best across the whole world. And right now, Estralis running away with game one. 27 minutes in. It was Cristiano Ronaldo with the first, and it's Arnaud with the second. He concedes a third. They're going over to the Xbox with a one goal advantage. Estralis, there's the cutback. Surely back to Ronaldo. Brilliant block. Pele with an awful touch there. You're thinking that's going to be a guaranteed goal. Get the confidence going. Just getting bullied off the ball in midfield. Every single time Houston goes forward, it looks like he's going to score. Pele, this time, heel to heel, teasing and teasing that battle line. Mbappe to Ronaldo, that's absolutely brilliant. Just simply too good in the final third is Houston right now. Capability. He's had nothing to deal with in all honesty. He's the only chance he may have had to deal with. When he won that game 6-0, when he won it, he didn't even look happy. He just thought it was all business for him. Business is resumed. Of course, that was for Bromby back then. Chance, goal number four. Why not? Well, we. What a first leg this has been from Mishalas. And he still doesn't look happy with it. He knows he's not jobbed up. It's a long old road, this best of five. But that is the best of starts for Team Astralis. Gets it done, gets another result for a third time in the tournament. Astralis will be your zone four winners. Any time of one minute's been played, get the ball out of play. That will be the first point on the board. Job done in the first game. What a performance from Ooston right there. You see the live shots, he's one happy man. I think Agger has had some unbelievable results. Oli Bolly, even if he went to penalties for some of his games, has not dropped a match. And also, something you have to consider, Brandon, one leg of FIFA. Extra time and penalties is very much. Six rounds in the groups to then finally draw a game. And then in the knockouts, as you can see, penalties, penalties, penalties everywhere. And there's another goal for Oli Bolly. Nine minutes in. A reaction is needed into his team makers camp and it's come in the form of Oli Bollock by Cristiano Ronaldo. Just the way that the script really sort of is going right now. Oli Bollock, 1-0 up against Aga. You see the man. Qualifier number one in the FIFA 21 Global Series. The PlayStation final it was Oli Bolly against Astralis' very own Houston. He did win that game, Oli Bollock. First outing as a team makers player. First trophy. For the club as well. Lovely scoop turn from R9! August Rosemeyer! Instant reply from Agon. That is a man zoned in to do Astralis proud right there. Great scoop turn from R9 and then rocketed off that right boot into the top left corner. We've got our game in our hands. Agon will not go quietly. Only one stat and one loss next to his name for Aga in this tournament. That was against this man on your screen in Oli Bolly. Aga now looking for a second of Trent Alexander Arnold all the way from fullback. Will look to play for the free kick. He wins that. Looking probably to cross that into the box and get R9 
Oh, Cristiano Ronaldo. There's Ronaldo going to loop towards the back post, you'd like to think. Ronaldo is at the back post. It's headed back out for a corner. One thing you know about Oli Bullock. He loves Same. the penalty shoots out. Cristiano Ronaldo! Genius. Genius from Aga right there. He had the corner on. The, the taker, he switched it so quickly that Oli Bully wasn't able to move his goalkeeper out quick enough to come and collect the ball with the right stick. Instantly took the corner, whipped straight into CR7, who headed it past the goalkeeper. Completely turned the game around. He saw it a couple of times, just teased on that free kick minutes before the corner. If I was looking just to sort of get Cristiano Ronaldo on the ball, look to manually control him. He really has a leap like no other in the box. Estralis up by two goals to one in this game after being 1-0 down in nine minutes. He's been grinding for the last 12 months when a lot of other people maybe have, have slacked off a little bit. He's been on it, has Oli Bollin. His results have mimicked that grind. Yeah, and they've earned him a move to team makers as well. Team makers, they did some serious business in the summer. August Rosemeyer could be on for a third. Gonna stay composed! And that's exactly what he's gonna do. A simple ball roll to slide that one past the goalkeeper. Agar with a two-goal cushion now in this game. Incredible through ball down the line. Finding CR7. As soon as he's in one-on-one, -on -one, you ask, does he have the minerals to finish? Ball roll past the goalkeeper. August Rosemeyer, since going 1-0 down, has been incredible. He's had three chances and scored three goals. He's been clinical. He's also defended, though, as well. He's not allowed Oli Bolli in. Last chance of the half. Got a minute. But in time when he played. Can he find R9 in the box for Oli Bolli? Defended well again. Last chance. But a witness in the air. And now he's there. That restores some hope for Oli Bolli. A shake of the head from Oli Bolli. That corner whipped into the box. CR7 wins it. The goalkeeper came a little bit, but didn't fully commit. 3-2 at half-time. What a first 45 minutes. In the pot again and looking for another side to win in this competition. Back on the way! Oh, nearly. Another 10 minutes pretty much gone here, Richard. That's a brilliant ball into Alfonso Davies. If he can do well to get round the mouth, oh, get round the corner, that was a pass that R9 nearly got a touch up. Teammakers desperate for a win here. This would be Oli Bolly's first loss across the groups and the knockout stages in the FIFA 3 Club World Cup. Charles, this is his own half. Disrupts the back line well. Unbelievable interception again. Some of that last ditch tackling from August Rosemeyer has been so clutch in the one-on-ones, in the interceptions. This is Oli Bolly's final throw of the dice. Is he in? Could be through. Look at the numbers he's got forward. Surely not. This would be remarkable. Patrick Vieira, that's why he's there. Get the ball clear. Estralis have just pulled off an absolute miracle. August Rosemeyer brings Oli Bolly's upbeaten streak to an end. It was the game that we were questioning. Oli Bolly has been the star of this team makers team in terms of those big match moments, the penalty shootouts, the knockout football. August Rosemeyer, they're made up of these big match moments, as Mateo was saying, you know, August Rosemeyer may have had those ups and downs, but he's a 2014 world champion, still in the conversation, still playing top FIFA now, many years on from that. On the flip side, this man on your screen is a 2018 E-Club World Cup champion in Ouston. Could he be the only player to be a two-time winner in this competition? Will be team makers kicking from left to right that have to win this game. Makers Principe, one of the longest serving players for any team. Brilliant start, brilliant start! A must win game! for team makers and Principe keeping his calm in the final third with Cristiano now to get him underway with a huge goal through group one it was of course Estralis in it's second past him. them in third chance to score a second potentially so for Principe lovely scoop turn back to Ronaldo tries to heal till his way past Virgil van Dijk 
More confidence, though, from Principe than what we saw in that entire first game. Great ball down the line, and Mbappe could be in. Could be in trouble. Oh, no, he's in the box. Thruston, can he find the comeback? Oh, it's a brilliant idea. Ronaldo just couldn't arc and sort of curve his run in the direction towards that back post through. One of the easiest tap-ins he would have scored all day. Things around in this best of five. Last chance of the game. In this first 45, I should say. Pele. Thruston does well. Still Pele. Lovely directional nutmeg. There's the comeback! And there's the equaliser! Principe, I'll be thinking... How have I not got myself out of this half with the one goal advantage? But when it where it's due, down the byline, be one of the best players we've seen in this tournament. An opportunity for them to turn it round. On the flip side, if Houston can score this now, Ronaldo oh. teases well, and that's what Houston's all about. Two goals in five minutes, and the great Dane is back on top once again. Coming out in this second half like a house on fire is Houston. August Rosemeyer somewhere. Now in Copenhagen. Not job done yet, but a brilliant turnaround. Now, Principe looking to reply instantly. Pele dancing in the box. That's absolutely fantastic. The scoop turn, the ball rolls, the combination drop point. And that's what Pele could do. Not only what Pele could do, that's what Principe can do. When he lets the shackles go. Unbelievable goal. Ball roll, scoop turn. He's perfect. Momentum to go forward, brilliant from Mbappe, lovely directional nutmeg. Ronaldo, brilliant directional Ooh. nutmeg, again, CR7, brilliant save. Good Prince of A's beam of disrupting this back line, he's got Cruyff there, he's fresh off the bench, can he turn his man? Ronaldo, interchange as well, directional nutmeg to remember, Prince of A! If I need to do it again in game five, I will do it again. Ronaldo, dancing in the box, that would have been... Look at the run, the Look Bruyne. at the race, De Bruyne, oh, again, Maldini, clutch. That's a rewrite some history for himself, never beating Houston, what a time to do so. Get the ball forward, we will be going into a game, number four, Principe, he knows it as well. A simple nod of the head, when he was asked of, to come up with a, back, a, a big result, sorry, he's done exactly that, and his teammate right now might be saying, okay, that's why I joined this teammaker's side. Now we go again. Oli Bully. Can he go and pull this one around? He's only lost one game in the tournament. That came in this best of five final. He's been, no doubt, the most consistent player in the FIFA e Club World Cup. Actually dropped a couple of points for his team. Charles, lovely fake shot. Lovely goal. Brilliant start for Oli Bully. The first time fake shot is proving to be a real dribbling technique and skill move that you have to have in your locker. Lovely volley again, further this one got up by a goal to nil, looking for a second with Ronaldo again, lovely directional, nutmeg, what a save by Van der Sar in his right hand, huge save. Can see every single corner, it's always into Ronaldo, brilliant pass, Ronaldo this time, cheeky chip, oh! Ronaldo, directional, nutmeg, that's a bit penalty! That's going to be a penalty, went for the directional nutmeg, Virgil van Dijk fell into the tackle, and what an opportunity this will be, Haragi to tie things up, it will be Cristiano Ronaldo, Mr. Reliable, you'd like to think from the spot. Steps up for Raggy, and he's saved! Straight down the middle, with no cursor, you don't want to overdo it, you don't want to fully commit to one side and potentially put it wide. Defence and midfield, standing strong for both players. Vieira, that's a great ball into Trent Alexander-Arnold, can he whip it into the box? Charge Ronaldo, well played, Jack. Ronaldo, lovely scoop turn, here's Oli Bolly, chance, goal! And that's the two-goal cushion that he's been looking for for such a long time in this game. R9, Ronaldo. Is it too little, too late. Could this be one of the chances? Vieira of all players. Back to Ronaldo, CR7, trying to turn, trying to twist, trying to find a way around the corner. Could be offside, could be back on. Neymar there, Eusebio fresh off the bench, Oli Bolly to put the game to bed, Eusebio, there's the card back into it, Bappe cleared off the line, and still somehow not in the back of the net. That was a huge chance to kill the game off right there. Sealed this game off yet. Massive tackle. Agger, Bruno Fernandes, brilliant idea, can't find the feet of his forward. 
Another chance goes begging. Chance to put the game to bed. Oli Bollock. And to send us into a fifth and final game. Into Ronaldo! We're going to a fifth game. Game five. People may be sleeping on him as well. Player that won a tournament back in 2017. Uh, was a regional winner. Now Madrid all those years ago. But is always still remained in the conversation. He's played in three E-Club World Cups. There is a goal back for Aga. Might be more than the consolation in all honesty. You can't argue with trophy wins. The accolades are premium. And if you can get a Club World Cup under your belt, nobody can sort of even discuss that. You're the winner. You are the best team out of all the clubs that entered. 4-1 game over right there. Oli Bully will be taking us to a game five. And there you have it. 2-2 two, two in this best of five. That means we're going to a fifth matchup. Here we go for the final time in zone four. A series that has given us everything. Upsets, drama, penalties. The usual twists and turns of a, an E-Club World Cup in all honesty. Here he comes now with his first chance of the game. A couple of step overs from R9. Lay back to it. Great ball around the corner. Keepers off his line. Can he get the ball into the box? Back to Pelé! And first block falls in the favour of Team Astralis and their PlayStation representative, a man that wants to make it two E Club World Cup championships. That's all right. Field position. Wins it back well. Here's Ronaldo. Lovely directional nutmeg. Brilliant goal. Principe squares things up. Game one to game five. Principe. Just looks a different man right now. Remember, whoever wins this game will win zone four of the FIFA E Club World Cup. Stralis against team makers. $27,500 on the line. Well played again down the byline. So, so good as Houston wins a corner. Watch for Ronaldo. Ronaldo's there. Ronaldo's up in the air. It's another great save. In comes Ronaldo again. Ronaldo's there again! Every single time that man leaps above any player. Team makers to come forward. Neymar off the bench into Ronaldo. Look at the space. Charles Ronaldo! You cannot write Principe out again. So the last 15 minutes, Principe has been shocking. It looked like he was going to walk the ball into his own net. He was giving the ball away at every opportunity. And then out of nowhere, Scores! Good chance each, if not more. That's Here's nice. Mbappe. Lovely directional nutmeg. Ball rolls away from Maldini. Charles back in front, clawed away off the line. Added time of a minute. Was on. Didn't even want to go forward. Couldn't even go forward. We need 30 more minutes to conclude this one. To defend from right to left. Here comes Ronaldo. Again for Principe <laughs> off the post. Oh, what an opportunity. He's got Cruyff in the box. Mbappe down the byline. Lovely drag back. Houston still in possession. Tries to dance his way around three or four defenders, just cannot find a way through. Any club World Cup champion now, it's got to be better for him. A long ball forward, is that too heavy for Mbappe? Slightly yes. so. Principe, he'll get a chance. Last chance of the game. Last chance to be a hero. Penalties to decide the zone four winners here in Europe. It's that simple. Here we go. Principe to step up first of R9, scores. Cultured penalty as well from Principe. Johan Cruyff for Astralis. Misses! What an awful penalty! For two out of two for team makers. They must have step up. Scores! Pressure is on Patrick Vieira right now for Houston. He's missed again! It's an awful start. Three out of three, surely. Saved! Houston must get it on target. Never mind score. Put the ball in the big net. Scores he eventually. Needs to save this one though, Richard. Upstairs Bruno Fernandez, surely from the spot. Cheeky Penenka. And this is where they have to score. They miss. It's game over. Upstairs Ronaldo. He does score. Pressure, penalty for Mbappe. Score, and you will be the FIFA 21 Club World Cup champion. It's so far, and he does score. Team makers. The reverse sweep is complete.
Huge penalty shootout from Mr. Makers in Principe. The man that's been in this organisation since 2017. He may have been in the background, he may have been quiet. Being his third appearance in the FIFA E Club World Cup. That's what it means to him, that's what it means to his teammate. They might be in Italy, they might be in Sweden. But that will tell you everything you need to know. Not just zone four winners. Can you tell us how he and you must be feeling right now? I mean, I'm still shaking after Principe's uh, penalty shootout. And I, and I mean, he wrote to me like after the semifinals that he, he was sorry because he lost. Uh, and I said, I mean, you are going to clutch up in the biggest moments and you know it then because I know that you are very good. Yeah, I'm so happy for Principe. Congratulations to both of you. Well done. Absolutely phenomenal performance. Wow.